In this video, I want to show you how to read a patient medical monitoring system. This particular brand is called a Dragger Infinity Delta, but it doesn't matter what kind of monitoring system you have. It basically measures the vital signs of a patient. And this monitoring system is currently in real time hooked up to a patient. And as you can see here, she is on oxygen. It's hooked up to her nose directly. And she's also on a blood pressure monitor. So I'll tell you what all these mean. Um, and what the sound means if it makes a dinging noise with a yellow indicator. Basically that means something's off with one of the vital signs. The very top vital sign, 82, that's heart rate per minute. So that's pretty self-explanatory. Her heart's beating 82 minute times per minute. And you want that value to be anywhere between 60 to 100. If it's over 100, it's you're usually exercising or it's not as efficient. And then lower, um, you know, close to 60, it's a little bit more efficient usually. The second line is the ST mini trend values. That's pretty much something I want to ignore, but usually the value is going to be 0.01, and that's basically showing the lines of the trends of these lines. The third one is oxygen. That that's the oxygen saturation, and that where it says 86, you really want that value to be between 95 and 100. She's got some fluid on her lungs right now, so she's not breathing as efficiently, um, and that's why it's low. Usually, if it gets below 85, out of range, um, it's going to ding and make a dinging sound. It'll turn yellow. So, right now they're telling her that she that she really needs to be at 90 before she can get up to 95. But again, that value measures how much oxygen percentage oxygen in the blood, and you want that to be between 95 and 100. The number below that is PLS, is pulse of the oxygen, and that um, pretty much is close to your heart rate. You want to see that those two numbers are pretty close together. The third number, RESP in blue, that's basically how many times respiration rate is how many times um, you are breathing per minute and you really want that to be between 12 and 20 that number right there as you can see there she's breathing hard at 51 breaths per minute or 38 now 32 and that's because of her oxygen and then the bottom number she is on a blood pressure monitor it reads like every couple hours and right now it's 138 per, by 87 that's actually lower for, than what she's been but you want that number to be 120 uh, um, or 80 around that um, and you don't want it to go really higher than 160 over 90 and really below 110 over 60 um, the top number measures how hard the heart is pumping blood out of the heart and the bottom number which is 87 it measures how hard it's pumping out of out of the heart whereas the top one is into the heart no, it's opposite. The one, the top number 138 is how hard it's pressing out of the heart, and the 87 is in, back into the heart. And that's her blood pressure right there. So that's pretty much a quick um, tutorial on how to read a uh, measuring um, system like this. If you have any questions, put it in the comment section. Make sure you subscribe, and thanks for watching.